and welcome to In the Chair. I'm Brenton Garren, your executive editor of Westside Today. I'm joined by Sandra Fook, who is a Democratic candidate for the new 26th state Senate seat. Sandra, and I am in the chair. You are in the chair. Well, welcome. <laughs> Thank you very much. Let's dive right into it. There's a couple of open seats this June primary. Can you share why you decided to run for the state Senate? You know, this for me is about continuing the work that I've always spent my career on. I've been a public interest advocate. I've represented victims of domestic violence, survivors of human trafficking, worked on a lot of social justice issues around living wage concerns, public assistance, fighting for our community. So for me, this is really one more step in what my career has always been about and a way that I can most effectively stand up for a community I care so much about and for the needs of the folks living here. Well, as a women's rights activist, and you've had some national spotlight in the past few years, a bit. what's the response been like since uh, announcing that you're going to run for this seat? Well, I have been just, I mean, I'm just really touched by the outpouring of support that I've received from around Los Angeles as well as other parts of the country. But I, I do want people to know, you know, this is this is a tough race and there's a, there's a lot of candidates in this. So I really hope that folks will go to standwithsandra.org. That's standwithsandra.org and sign up to be part of the campaign and to, to stand together and create the kind of change that we began to create in 2012 and that we've got a long way to go to accomplish. Mm -hmm. So as a potential newcomer to Sacramento, what sort of issues do you think you could tackle on that state level? Well, I've actually been in the Los Angeles area making my home here for about seven years. I lived on 4th Street in Santa Monica, right on the border between Venice and Santa Monica, up from, up from Rose. And I know a lot about what the community concerns are here. We clearly have a beautiful, beautiful community, the, the bay, the mountains, this district. So protecting our environment and making sure that we're able to leave that to generations to come to enjoy is really critical. And it's one of the things that I will absolutely focus on in Sacramento. Right now, we have some particular concerns around implementation of the Affordable Care Act. We're, we're on the right path, but we've got a lot of room to grow. There is a lot we can do to improve that. So that's one of the things I'll focus on in Sacramento. And no matter where you go, the first thing people will tell you they want elected officials to be doing something about is doing everything they can to create good, well-paying jobs. That's going to have to be absolutely one of my top priorities. You know, I am encouraged by things like Silicon Beach here um, in Venice, in, in Marina del Rey, in Santa Monica as well. And I want to think about the ways that we can encourage that industry, help that to grow, and that we can have make sure all of our industries are growing. And uh, what part of the district do you live in? Right now I'm in West Hollywood. Okay. And what do you like most about the area? You know, one of the things I love about both West Hollywood and Santa Monica is their walkability. Mm -hmm. The fact that there are strips where you can walk from stores to restaurants, and that's clearly important for encouraging our small businesses, but also really great from an environmental perspective that folks can get out and walk around. And it's one of the reasons that we have a strong sense of community. And that's true throughout the district. You know, we have that in Manhattan Beach as well. Um, so that's one of the things I, I really love about living here. Well, Sandra, good luck and thank Thanks, you for joining man. us. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me in the chair. Absolutely. <laughs> we'll be back next week, so don't forget to check out westsidetoday.com to see who's in the chair. I'm Brenton Garren for Westside TV.